Hey y'all, I'm back with another video. So let's see how the Carmen feels about the masculine and about what they got going on. Let's see, let's start off with the Kipper. Wow. <laughs> okay. So at the bottom of the deck, we have poverty here. And the Eight of Swords. Well, not the Eight of Swords, imprisonment. But this gives me Eight of Swords energy. Um, She feels like, we got Thief. She feels like she took masculine out of a messed up situation and put him in a better one. So she feels like she... Gave him a family, put him in a family unit, brushed him off, gave him some love, worked with him while he was uh, down bad. She felt like she lifted him up. She felt like she took him from out of a poverty situation. I feel like we got mature women here in occupation. Um, someone's um, mother could be involved, like his mother or his aunt or his older. I'm getting someone older than him, though. Um, she could be working together with this older, mature woman to uh, try to change his situation because we got distant horizons and mature man kind of like bring him out of this poverty um imprisonment that he was in so it looks like when it looks like it looks like he, it looks like he's being judged or he's judging himself. He's real hard on himself about his money and how things look. Yeah, because where he come from, he ain't have a lot. We got despair and journey. Yeah, and saying that every, ever since he's been dealing, she feel like ever since he's been dealing with her, he's changed. Okay, so, yeah, she feel like she gave him uh, a family, like she gave him something that he was missing. A piece of his life that was missing. So she felt like she cleaned him up. She done invested in him. Brought him some new clothes. Brought him some new shoes. All of that stuff. So she she really mothered him. <laughs> She's playing his mother. Okay. Um. Show me what else. How does Carmen feel about her and masculine? We got a camera and seduction. Oh, oh. Paradise and X. Okay, and then we got the chaser and hammer at the bottom. She the chaser. She was steady chasing out the masculine. Because she got abandonment issues. She's scared that the relationship is going to be sabotaged. 
she's afraid to have to rebuild or start over because she done put so much work in and she done been too persistent. Um, this says kisses and palm tree. It's like when it was going through my head is K-I-S-S-I-N-G. Real childish type of energy. But I'm just getting like she definitely is in love with him. Okay, we got unconditionally loving, giving, and receiving affection, falling in love. So she's really like giving, 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 giving to, to masculine to make him comfortable, give him stability and security. Now, I want to see why seduction is here. She feels like she feels like when she's not around him, he deals with other parties that he engage in these um, engage with these other women. She knows this about him already. There's not nothing new. She done dealt with that before. She done dealt with that before, possibly like in a previous relationship, or she's used to. She's used to it. But see, the thing about it is, is she could also feel like it's just rumors. Um, because we got coffin and the sword and rose. Like she doesn't want to believe it. She don't feel like it's true. Cause she feel like she got his heart. They talk all the time. Like, they they have a really open communication. But he don't tell her everything. <laughs> he not telling her everything. Yeah. See, the Grim Reaper and Paradise. This person, Maslin could be married. And need to get a divorce. She wants to get engaged. She wants to level up in the connection. She wants to take things to the next level. Mm. But somebody, Maskell said not today. <laughs> Maskell said no. Maskell said no. We got X right here. So this is like a breakup or a separation. Why is X here? Addiction. She's addicted to him. Um, she sure is. She is addicted to masculine. She took a big risk on him. But best believe she she playing chess. She playing chess. See, she she wants a ring. She wants the connection to go to a higher level. So she took a chance on him. She knew it was a risk, but she being strategic. Okay. She's trying to get this ring right here. She wants that ring. Yeah, she said it's time for them to evolve to the next level. I can't make it up. Clock. Butterfly. Twin flames. Wedding rings. She said, "Look, we've been dating. We've been dating for a while. We've been dating. I've been giving you everything that you asked for. All right. So it's time for us to take things to the next level. It's time for our connection to ascend." Hmm. Hmm. She said, "It's time to take it to the next level." Boop. 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 <laughs> boop. Boop. All right, let's see what masculine want to do. Let's see what masculine got to say.
King of Cups. <laughs> okay, so we got the Ace of Swords, the Six of Cups, and the Page of Pentacles, and the Six of Wands, the King of Wands, Strength, Nine of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, and the Two of Wands. So he feels like it's time to tell the truth about his past. He feel like it's time for him to tell the truth about his past. I told you she don't know the whole truth. She don't know the whole truth. She could be a Leo. We got the strength card here. King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, lots of fire energy. She could be dealing with the fire. She could be a fire sign. Why is the Six of Cups here? What's going on in his past? What's Mm. He's the player player. Tell me more about this night of wands. See, he got somebody that he's been going back and forth with dealing with from his past. Yeah, three of pentacles is a third party. This person could be a queen of cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This could be you. This is a very divine feminine energy. Okay. I told you. Somebody's masculine is married. Still, they ain't got no divorce yet. They ain't getting no divorce yet. See, he walked away from this feminine energy and he's been regretting it ever since. He's been regretting it ever since. Okay, he knew he was gonna. He knew he was gonna regret it, but he felt like if he fell in love and he hurry up and tell, talk, tell her, then their relationship would grow to the next level. See, he was supposed to keep the lie going, but he ended up getting stuck in this third party. Yeah, he ended up getting stuck in it. See, the challenge is the truth. Him not being completely honest about... Um, him not being completely honest. He, he wasn't completely honest. Why was the extra swords here? We got the star and the ten of pentacles. See, he wants to heal this uh, marriage here, this commitment, this this union. He ain't moved on from that yet. See, <laughs> but he was trying to stop himself from going back and forth. Okay, so why is the star here? Seven of Pentacles. He was just hoping that it was worth it. He just jumped in this connection and just hoping that it was going to be worth it. Yeah, see, he don't, he feel. Why is the Page of Pentacles right here? See, he don't feel like a man until he's able to tell her the truth. Okay, so he got some stuff that he got to get off his chest. 
but he hasn't yet. For whatever reason, he's scared. For whatever reason, he just feels stuck. But he's having a lot of regrets, okay? So I'm getting guilt, especially with the Five of Cups and the Eight of Swords. He's feeling guilty about something from his past that he keeps going back and forth about. Um, and she doesn't even, she's not even fully aware. She's not even fully aware. But he wants to tell the truth. He wants to open up there and tell the truth. But then he feels like he'll have to move on. Six of Swords and a Chariot. But he's been dragging his feet. He's been dragging his feet because he's been sitting here enjoying the ride with her. See, yeah, see. Wow. He's definitely heartbroken. We got past energy. He's definitely heartbroken. He's trying to heal and get over something from his past. He is not he is not fully over his past. Okay. That relationship, this connection that he had with Divine Feminine, this man was in love. The lovers in attending cups. Divine Feminine. Why is the King of Wands here? Wow. Tower. Mm -hmm. I knew that was coming. He knew that if he knew that if he was to pull these stunts that he's pulling with her, he can't pull that with Divine Feminine. Mine's the strength card here. The sun wants to jump. Definitely picking up Leo. Why is the strength card here? The Queen of Cups. Yeah, see, the Queen of Cups, this Divine Feminine. This energy keeps keeps presenting itself, okay? See, Masculine, he had a choice that he had to make. I keep getting that masculine walked away from his from his twin flame. This is the twin flame card is also the marriage card. He walked away from his uh from his twin flame. He walked away. Because somebody got caught lying, got caught cheating, got caught being sneaky. So either you left or he left. Tell me more about this. Queen of Pentacles. See, Masculine had plenty of options. He had plenty of people that he just had sitting on hold. Okay, he had a couple of little things that we got her me. Virgo. He was out here being single. Nine of Pentacles. He was out here being single and having fun. Living life. He was taking that to the fullest. He was going and rocking out with his cock out. Tell you that for sure. She still want them. She still want them. He he just wanted to give he just wanted to give this a try first before he left before he leaves her. He just waiting for her to cheat back. He waiting on her to cheat back. He said that the sex is good and that's it. Two of Wands here as the outcome. Ten of Wands. I'm telling you, he got Ten of Wands and the Seven of Cups. He plans on dropping all his options, but he's not sure if he can actually do it. He's not sure. He don't want to see if it's a if it's a, some uncertainty. Then that means that you don't really, that's not something that you really want to do. It got to be no doubt in your mind. See, he don't even, he, she wants him to drop all his options. He ain't going to do that. So 
So they could be together. The four of wands and the three of cups. That's like a wedding, a ceremony, a whatever. He's not willing to drop no other options. He's not. And he still has to be completely honest about his past. He's still in love with uh, Divine Feminine. And he's still got other options. He's still got other suitors that he's balancing and juggling. Like, he's not. He's It's not giving what it's supposed to be giving. Like, she wants something more stable. and But she's trying to get it from somebody who's already... St who's still connected to someone else okay so that's the message that i got y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below all right